Hello everyone, so here's a bit of a short video that I did decided to make, nothing special, but over here I have these Pentax lenses, a quite old set of lens for cameras and very high quality. You can see the label, it says Super Takumar and it's made in Japan. There is something quite special about them. What's special is that they use glass that has thorium in it. And thorium is radioactive. So, in background radiation, something like this, around 27 CPM. Let's see how much it reacts to this. Ooh, quite a bit, doesn't it? Let's wait until it completely fills up, and let's see the value that we get. Should be something quite high. That thing is loud. This might be one of the most radioactive items I've measured yet, honestly. The uranium glass that I have doesn't even closely match this. Just leave it like that. Hopefully, it doesn't fall down. Yeah. It's amazing that this Geiger counter can even survive this onslaught without like, rebooting or crashing. Wow. The sound itself is derping a little bit. That doesn't sound healthy, honestly. So, the max value was like around 3.8 thousand counts per minute, that's around 28 microsieverts per hour, that's a lot, that's uh, quite a few dental x-rays per hour, honestly, I wouldn't mess with that. But as soon as we move it, it goes down again, so yeah. That's quite a bit. Uh, is this thing safe to use? If it's inside the camera, probably. If you don't constantly like wear it on your skin, I don't know, like wear it like hold it like this for hours and hours, it's probably safe. The camera will block most of the radiation anyway. For instance, uh, I like if this was put on, which is the extender for the lens. There's already almost nothing there, just a little bit. So I imagine that a camera would completely block everything there. The other side actually doesn't even emit any radiation, it's just the back side. So if we turn this around and try to measure the upper, or rather outer lens, see? Nothing. The only one that we're getting is probably from the other lens. So, so yeah, just a short video about the most powerful source I found so far. Nice.